Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome back to the channel. It is 5.30 a.m. I know I'm up early all the time. Uh, and we're not going to a car event, as you can see from the thumbnail. We are going to Roselli's in San Jose. We're finally at that point where we've hit 12,000 miles on the Alfa Romeo 4C. So we're taking it to him. He is a, a well-known and respected name here in the Bay Area when it comes to exotics. He has a lot of Italian cars there. If you haven't seen my video that I did with uh, Mo Boost uh, Marino when we dropped off his Gallardo there, uh, he has a ton of beautiful exotics right there. Uh, so yeah, I'm headed to work. After work, we're taking the car there. You're not, you're not gonna see me at work, but. Uh, you'll get to see all the beautiful cars he has there in the shop. So yeah, stay tuned. All right, off of work in the Alpha, and it is a beautiful day here in the Bay Area. Uh, gonna head out. It is almost 80 degrees. Oh yeah. Here we are in the city of San Jose. 81 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah, it is. It's definitely feeling like springtime now here in the Bay Area. Look at that, parked right behind a Gallardo, the beautiful Maserati, Ferrari, and there is an, an Aventador right there. Oh yeah, and there's also a Diablo. Yep. And if you guys follow me on the channel, uh, our friend Austin, his 4C got into a little bit of funk. But no doubt Rosselli will get them back and running in no time. At the Ferrari California, what I would consider affordable for a Ferrari. And I don't think it's on my list, but why not? A beautiful Diablo. The Rolls Royce, we saw this here last time. It's huge. It's huge seeing a Rolls Royce parked next to like a 458. This Diablo just looks humongous, like almost like a short truck or something. <laughs> Another Diablo, Ferrari. Yeah, look at all these Ferraris lined up. Super nice. Oh, <laughs> something special for that. Well, actually, that's a Marcia Lago. Wow. I think the first time I see one in person. That's amazing. Wow. Wow. Beautiful cars. It's really packed, so I'm not going to go too far in to look at everything. Oh. Yeah, look how everything's just kept here. And we're going to go... Yeah. We'll go around and... Ooh, I like that red inside the Maserati. We'll go around to the sides and see what else is out there. Guys, this is super windy out here, but check out the wrap on this. Gallardo, this is super shiny. We got a few really nice ones out here. The super nice 911. Oh man, this is dreams on dreams over here. The Maserati, the Ferrari, California love right here. We got the fellows here cleaning up that Maserati. We got the Bentley. Actually, the Bentley, believe it or not, is actually on my list of cars to get as well or something that i could possibly get yeah because believe it or not there is one that is somewhat affordable i just don't know much about them and it's not high on my list of something to get uh, but we'll see oh look at this the bentley actually has a carbon fiber trunk that looks awesome as well the beautiful air cooled with the ducktail you guys know how i feel about the ducktail super nice now beautiful lineup of some gallardos we got the Targa 911 there as well. Another Ferrari. Look at this. Not quite Marino, but you get the picture if you've seen his car. Uh, this is probably what it might have looked like before it got all changed up to look like a, a newer version. I know you guys know the LPs and the non-LPs and uh, long play and short plays, but I don't know that stuff. So... <laughs> <laughs> watch his uh video where i interview him uh talking about his uh, and you'll get what i'm talking about but yeah this is probably what it may have looked like before not exactly in this color but uh as far as like these louvers over here and uh the tail lights that's more of what his looked like before uh check out this wild maserati 
Uh, the color on this and the rim size is definitely not something you would see normally stock on a Maserati, but uh, why not? I mean, it's your car. Have fun with it. Do what you'd like. Do this. You guys know how I feel about having my cars in white. This Gallardo is super nice. It's uh, like a satin or matte finish on it. And yeah, the orange calipers on this one, super nice. The carbon fiber side skirt looking just nice. Love the fact that you can see the engine out here. And of course the carbon fiber spoiler. Uh, I feel like you need a carbon fiber diffuser, but this blacked out diffuser looks really nice. The front on these are just menacing super nice really love this seriously guys i know i messed with you guys on the last video but seriously this would be really nice to have and honestly i think i would be able to pick something like this up in the near future seriously let me know your thoughts on this because i think out of everything uh a ferrari would be nice but i think i don't know i think my heart's really telling me gallardo or lamborghini instead yeah it's tough but let me know what you guys think uh, the blue one's really nice too but I, I just i don't think i can do blue i, I love it. The, the way it looks is beautiful but i for myself i can't do blue targa is beautiful uh, but if we're going to compare that gallardo to something like this oh uh, is this a 360 let me know i need to do my research a lot better maserati would be nice as well but i think i'm leaning more towards Ferrari or Lamborghini let me know what you guys think if it's gonna be something like this or something like those yeah let me know all right guys I'm probably in a familiar spot <laughs> from the last video so we're gonna head home and by the time you guys see this video I will be with my 4C so yeah uh, we'll skip right to that day all right we are back at Rosselli's it is a few days later dropped it off like way ahead of time and look yeah here is my baby looks all done a little dirty but we'll wash her up and yeah we'll just uh go and see what the bill is like Ooh, but check out this avora before we go in just in case i don't see it before i leave in the gallardo yeah this wasn't here when i was tricking you guys for uh, april fools oh, look everyone there's my california <laughs> just kidding Ooh, for my alpha friends check this out what a beauty wow with the red interior amazing look at all these oh marcielago oh another alpha right here super nice and we we're here last time you guys remember austin's baby right here some parts are in and really confident she'll be up and running in no time look at the tail on this whale the turbo from montana Ooh. and this ferrari right here yeah check out the color that is something you know it's not one of my colors but i think i would keep it like this <laughs> call me crazy but yeah i think it looks good the aventador look at that god so menacing so beautiful and of course way long before the aventador was the diablo missing a countage but we, d we do have the aventador the diablo and of course we have a couple of mercies one way over there the yellow one and one in the garage right over there okay this is the one guys this is the one i would want it's already white it's got the carbon fiber and it's got the doors that go up holy moly this is nice hey how about this <laughs> pretty sweet you see that vent door starting up it's ready to go somewhere but yeah anyways got the 4c key in my hand that thing oh that thing sounds nice we got to see Austin's uh, 4C and it looks like it's already up in the shop. I know they got some parts and they're gonna work on that really soon too. Carl's car was here as well, but I think he actually ended up taking it 
and we'll be bringing it back. I don't know if that's too much personal information. Sorry, Carl. There's my baby. We're gonna go, but there's also a coffee shop over here that might still be open. It's not too late for coffee, is it? Guys, check this out, Chromatic. Shout out to them. You guys gotta come here. I'm about to try their drink for the very first time. It should be really good. The smell in this place is just, like you want it. You want it inside of you. So we're about to get that right now. Jeremy, a vanilla latte? That's it. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Have Take care. One. You too. Thanks. Woo we, we got our drink. Got a car? Go inside. All right, it is hot here in San Jose, so we'll turn her on. Ooh. We'll know right away if the change oil, oh yeah, change oil, change engine oil is definitely still on, so whew, I don't know what's going on with that. Like, maybe that'll go away. We'll, we'll leave it for a bit and see what happens. And while I'm waiting, try my drink. Yeah, it's showing. It's showing 88 degrees. 88 degrees here in San Jose. Mm. Highest coffee from Chromatic. I can't remember what the girl Zoe said this was, but it's their most popular drink. Someone's horn's going off. But this is delicious, especially in this weather. Still waiting to see if that oil light comes back on. So far, so good. Uh, yeah, I'll let you know. Well, we are back home and Alpha 4C just uh, missed it so much, even though it was only a couple of days, but just once you get back in and like the smell, the drive, it's just so nice. It, it's weird because like, I'll go like a whole week not driving it and then, but just something about it being out of shop for maintenance and then coming home with it that just, I don't know, it's a good feeling. I don't know if that's weird. Make, let me know if you, that makes sense anyways yeah in the garage there's something missing that's another story anyways if you guys like the video make sure to like it subscribe if you haven't already done so comment share with anyone that might like this type of content and i'll talk to you guys later